Hello everyone. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to composite 3D objects into real footage. I just recently finished this work and you can watch this example. As you can see, there is a real footage on the background and 3D ship from Star Wars movie. Falcon named and we will achieve this effect together uh, this is my first tutorial I may have some mistakes but anyway let's start first we need After Effects bring it our original footage and make it JPEG seconds we won't make any changes in this original footage directly we will render it to render queue and choose JPEG seconds. That is it. We choose the final destination folder. And, uh, this is important, by the way. This is important because for some reason Maya doesn't recognize the numbers and underscores. We have to change this. And I will make this image seconds. Everything seems normal. And let's render it. And it's done. Do not save. Okay. We need our image seconds. Open, load seconds. Where it is best up space tutorial and this is our seconds. Hit OK and now we are in match mode. Okay, everything seems normal and we need our track points. We can use 3D tracking, sorry, 2D tracking, automatic automatic tracking, but I do not use Generally, because there is a lot of point, uh, points in automatic tracking, it confuses everything and it's really slow. So we will make our tracks ourselves. We will choose new track. The tracking is it a bit tricky, because you have to choose right points for the track. For example, you cannot choose like this spot, like this, because there is not high contrasted edges. We need high contrasted edges for our track points to work. As you can see, this is good. It's okay. Maybe yes. yes. When I hit track one, um, ground tracking, and match mover automatically track the point you choose. If it's green or green, it means it's a good track. Computer can recognize the point all the way. As you can see, it seems normal. This is our first track. Match Mover is a complicated program. You can uh, make some practice and easily you can manage the tracking. This is our track 1 and we have to continue like this. Maybe 8 or 10 track. New track. Also, this seems good. Point. Yes, this one. Track three. Also, it seems good. It's it may seem slow, but trust me. If you compare to automatic tracking, it's really fast.
Okay, now our checkpoints are ready for the new coordinate system. Now we will define the coordinates. For this, we have to solve the camera first. Let's solve the camera from this button. It's good. There is 10 healthy track points ready for coordinate system. This is our new coordinate system. Click this, click the button. Now we will define the point relations. Where is X, where is Y, where is origin point? We have to choose and tell the computer. Now track 3, our origin point, because it's on the ground. Ground will be our origin point, track 3. Now we have to give numbers to computer to calculate distance from the points, from the two points. For this I will choose track 1 and track 8. It's almost 1 meter, 1 to 8. Distance 1 to 8 is 1 meter. This is why 100,000 distance. Now we will define the x axis. For this we will choose normal to 3 points. And I will choose each point to 9. 8 and to 10. 9, 8 to 10. This is x axis 9, 8 and 10. Now we choose our x axis. These three points shares, shares the x axis. Now the y. From yeah, 2 to 2 points. Now we have to choose two points which defines the y axis. For this I will choose from 5 to 4. From 5 to 4. Now everything seems normal and apply coordinate system. Let's check if our coordinate system is ready or not. So click 3D. Click, uh, press C to camera. Yeah, it's for che uh, for checking purposes. New cube will help us scale it up. And this will be our refer reference point for to see our the coordinate system is working or not. Aligned like this. And if it sticks the ground, it means our coordinate system is working. Yeah, it seems it's quite enough for our tutorial purpose. Yes, it sticks on the ground as you see. It's not, it's not flying or jumping around. It means our coordinate system is correct and ready for exporting to the mine. Okay, I will delete this cube. 